Let's solve this easy level lead code question in two different ways. Given two integers x and y, return the Hamming distance between them. The Hamming distance between two integers is the number of positions at which the corresponding bits are different. For example, if x equals 1 and y equals 4, to find the Hamming distance between them, we need to compare the bits by their positions. And counting the different positions gives us two. The first solution is short and simple. Let's create a function named Hamming distance that takes x and y as parameters. Using the bitwise XOR operator, we get a new number where each bit is 1 only if the corresponding bits in x and y differ. Then we convert this to a binary string using two string with a base of 2. Finally, we split the string by 1 and count the resulting array length minus 1 which gives us the number of 1s in the binary representation. Let's see if it passes and it does. The second solution is more efficient. Again, we calculate x, x or y and store it in a variable, initialize a counter to zero, start a while loop and iterate over each bit, use bitwise end operator with one to check if the rightmost bit is one, if it is, increment the counter, right shift the number to check the next bit, this loop will continue until no more bits are left and finally return the count. Let's test it and this one passes as well.